so the way I've developed this course, it's, it's very uh, linear, like step one leads to step two, leads to step three. It's, I wanted to keep it simple. It's a grade 10 English class, and many of the students who take upper level classes, you know, start off maybe with an English 10 class, so it's a, it's a very basic, but it covers everything, and uh, it's a good introduction. Now the students hand in their assignments right through WebCT. There's an assignment drop box that they can uh, put their assignments in, or they can email them to the instructor through the course. We require all students to submit documents through the online management system so that we can keep track of what's been handed in. I think it, WebCT does a really good job of this because when a student like a student would see this on my course, answer the questions in Microsoft Word, perhaps, or whichever word processor they like. They would upload it to the Dropbox. It's called the Dropbox, and I get a an email notification saying that uh, you know John Smith has submitted um, the assignment from 1.1, and it's ready to be graded. So I don't constantly have to go back in and you know con like search to see if anybody sent it something in. If I don't get notified via email, I know that nothing's been added in. So it really cuts down on the amount of, of searching that I, as a teacher, have to do. And especially if a teacher has two or three courses with you know 30 or 35 kids in each one, you couldn't. There's not enough hours in the day to wonder if students have submitted something. So uh, many of the teachers use that in WebCT that they get notified 